What's going on guys? Welcome to another episode of Me Cooking in My Backyard. I'm Chef Q Soto and today we are making that Ori King salmon that I uh, had on my Instagram. If you guys follow me on there, uh, you see what the picture looks like. So this is the salmon right here. And these are some of the ingredients that we're gonna be using. We got some Cypress black salt, avocado, heavy cream, some garlic confit, kosher salt, edible flowers, a little bit of utensils, and uh, some poblano peppers. So right now we got the, uh, the charcoal heating up back there. So we're gonna go and roast those. But before that, we're gonna go ahead and start this bad boy up. This is what we're gonna be cooking on, the Timmer stoves, flat top. So let's go. So we're gonna wrap this and let those peppers sweat so the skin's gonna be a lot easier to peel off. And while that's going, we're gonna put our pot straight on the timber stove. I'm gonna throw in a little bit of cream. I'm gonna say about half a cup-ish. And I'm gonna let that heat up. Once that's heating up, we're gonna start dicing these up, the peppers, throw it into the cream sauce a little bit of kosher salt and then we're gonna blend that together before we even start our salmon because we only want to focus on the salmon itself once that's going so these peppers have been sweating for a few minutes and uh, I'm gonna go ahead and take the skin off but I'm gonna go ahead and take it inside just to show you guys this is how easy the skin comes off so I'm gonna go run these under some cold water and take it all off I'll be right back this is what the peppers look like clean. I'm gonna start dicing them up. Just gonna cut off the ends. And I'm basically just gonna take out as much seed and membrane as possible. And guess what, this doesn't have to be pretty because we're throwing it in cream sauce, cooking it down a little bit more, and then we're just gonna blend it all. It's getting all nice and warm. Throw in our peppers. I'm also gonna throw in three of these garlic cloves. Throw that back on, get these all flavors married together. to me if you guys want this um, a little thinner you can strain it if you want I'm gonna throw it back on and reduce it till it gets thick we'll pull the 
soft for a minute, it's starting to boil, and I don't want it to scorch while I prep my salmon. So how we're gonna do this is we're gonna start, we're gonna cook it on the skin side first. So I'm just gonna sprinkle a little salt on it. You wanna do this right before we cook it because if you let it sit, it's gonna start pulling moisture out of the fish. You wanna come over here? So I'm gonna hit this grill with avocado oil. I'm gonna throw the fish skin side down like I said, and the goal to get that crispy skin is to cook it about 90% of the way. So let's go ahead and start that now. Is our poblano cream sauce? Now that everything is done, I'm gonna build this beautiful dish. So first thing we're gonna start with is our roasted garlic poblano cream sauce. That's gonna be our base. Then our crispy king aura salmon. Some cypress black salt. This is herb oil. Put a couple of these garlic confits in there. That's it guys. There's our crispy king aura salmon with roasted poblano cream sauce and a herb oil with edible flowers and garlic confit. Hope you guys enjoyed this. I definitely enjoyed making it. Um, there's definitely gonna be more videos to come. Sorry I was a little late, it's been about a month since my last video. But other than that you guys, this is what I love to do. So stick around and I'll see you next time.